Do you love the smooth zooming effects of Screen Studio, but wished it worked on Windows or maybe that it was more affordable? Well, in this video, we're going to dive into the three best alternatives to Screen Studio you can use today. So Screen Studio is an extremely popular macOS screen recorder, mostly known for its smooth zooming effects and cursor movements. The main downsides of Screen Studio are, well, it's macOS only, so if you're Windows, I'm sorry, you can't use Screen Studio. The pricing is also pretty steep, and it's really not the best for long form videos because you can only record one video at a time. And so you need an external editor if you want to then stitch together every part of your long video. Now, if you're creating educational content like tutorials, video courses, and product demos, then my absolute favorite tool is called Borumi. You can start off by writing your script inside Borumi itself. This could be a word by word script or even just a bullet point list of the things you're going to talk about. The important thing is that you divide your video into scenes. Then you can start the recording process one scene at a time. This makes it so much easier to record longer videos because instead of having to nail the video in one go, you can just split it up and then record and retry each scene individually, making it much more manageable. Finally, when you finish recording, Brumi stitches together all your scenes in the built-in video editor. Then you can start refining your video. For example, you can trim your clips either from the timeline or from the transcript. For example, if you remove something from the transcript, it gets automatically reflected in the timeline below. And this saves so much time for longer videos. Then of course, you can also add smooth zooming effects and cursor movements, just like Screen Studio, which helps keeping the video more engaging. Barumi includes many built-in layouts to make your video look amazing. But of course, if you don't like them, you can fully customize them inside the canvas, something that it's not possible in Screen Studio. Also, unlike Screen Studio, Barumi works on both macOS and Windows making it more inclusive. In terms of pricing, Brumi comes as a one-time license currently discounted at $59, making it the most affordable video creation tool and the best value for your money. Our second alternative is Tela, which is great if you want to create good looking videos and instantly share them with other people similarly to Loom. Also in terms of platform support, Tela works on both Windows, macOS and Linux due to the fact that it's a web application. Tele is mostly famous for its many built-in layouts that will make your video look very good without much effort. The coolest feature of Tele is the ability to instantly share your video with a link, similarly to Loom, uh, which makes it very convenient, for example, if you want to create a sales demo to send to a potential client or send a team update to your colleagues. Also, Tele has a built-in zoom effects, but it doesn't look as smooth and polished as Borumi or Screen Studio. In terms of pricing, Tela only comes as a subscription starting at $12 per month when paid yearly, all the way up to $39 if you want more features. Our third alternative is called Focusy and was born as a cheaper alternative to Screen Studio. In terms of platform support, as Borumi, it runs on both macOS and Windows. Moreover, it includes cinematic zooming effects and smooth cursor movements, very similarly to Borumi and Screen Studio. In terms of recording, it's pretty easy to use. You can quickly record your camera and screen and then edit it in the built-in video editor. Now, unlike Borumi and Tela though, you can't record individual clips and then stitch them together. So it's more suited for shorter videos, shorter product demos and so on, and not for long form educational content. In terms of pricing, it's still pretty affordable coming at $69 as a one-time payment. So which one should you pick? If you're creating educational content like tutorials, video courses and product demos, then Borumi is a very solid choice thanks to its scene-based recording, which keeps the whole recording process manageable and the many effects you can apply in the built-in editor without switching to other applications. Also coming as a one-time payment at $59, it's probably the best deal out there and very hard to beat. If you want a quick way to record and share videos that still look good, then Tela might be a very solid choice. The main downside is that it forces you into subscription, which can get pricey over time. Now, if you want an easy way to record good looking short videos, then Focusy is also a good option. If you liked the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more tutorials, in-depth reviews, and everything you need to become a better creator.